Welcome to the Mega Technical Support videos. In this session, we're going to see how to get the logs from PowerDB. PowerDB logs all the activity in two different text files, one for the driver activity and one for the application activity. The driver log file called PDB driver log records the communication between the PowerDB software and the instrument firmware and other special messages logged by the software. So any instrument that you connect to PowerDB and interact with it, you uh, this uh, text file will log any activity in that communication process in any message uh, generated by the instrument. The application log records the activities of PowerDB application level, such as the versions, the opening process, database, and any other message generated by PowerDB. During the troubleshooting of an instrument issue or software issue, um, these driver logs and these application logs are very, very useful. So we may ask uh, for these files uh, when you are um, interacting with uh, any of the application engineers. To get those files, you just need to go to Tools here in the menu, and uh, you have uh, each file has its own icon here. Uh, <clears throat> this uh, driver log will be active if this checkbox is, uh, is selected, enable driver log. By default, the software should have these, but uh, if there's no uh, checkbox here, then we won't have any driver logs there. So, in that case, you will need to check it, uh, run one more test uh, for the instrument to generate the driver logs and uh, be able to, to get those. So in this case, I, it's already enabled. I just need to click on each of them. Uh, each button will uh, open uh, the file, a notepad file. We need you to save that uh, with Save As and uh, put it somewhere in your computer, uh, one location in your computer that you can easily go and recover those files to or, or get those files to put them in an email and send them to us. Driver log, the same thing. It opens, file, save as, and uh, same process. Once you have them, put them in an email and uh, send it uh, to the person that you are interacting with uh, in the technical support department. One more way to get these driver logs and these application logs is to go directly uh, through your Windows Explorer to your files and, and grab them for the from the uh, folder location where they are uh, saved. So this is the the route, uh, they are always under program data, PowerDB version 11.2 in this case, but uh, you just need to go to the folder that corresponds to the version that you're using. You may have uh, several versions already installed in your computer. If you have updated, you will still have those other folders from the past, but uh, just go to the recent, most recent folder. And then inside that, then you will have log files. So when you go to the actual file locations, file location, you, you're you going to see more than two files. The two files that I was showing before are these two. The PDB log is the application log, and then the PDB driver corresponds to the driver logs. If there's too much activity in PowerDB, these files have a limit. So what PowerDB does is that it uh, actually generates historic logs. Uh, in case the information we don't, we are looking for is not in the in the current logs, then we also can use the old logs. So this is actually better to sometimes to come directly to this location and grab all of these files and send them to us. Thank you for watching the technical support videos from Megger.